and peeps and fitness friends, it's Rayanne with Fitness Friday. The last Fitness Friday focusing in on feet. And next week we are going to start a whole new series of exercises for you to do during the summer if you can't make it to the studio. But today we're going to focus in on barefoot running or minimal shoe running or just running with less impact on your joints. So I know a lot of you like to run in the summer and you probably haven't been running a lot um, all winter long. So just a reminder, if you are gonna go out and run, make sure you do kind of a run walk to start out with and not run a long distance so that your body can work up to using those muscles again that you use in running that you haven't used all winter long. So what I'm gonna show you today is some different ways to learn how to run with um, a midfoot strike instead of a heel strike. Through research we know that um, hitting heel strike creates a lot more impact, significantly more impact on the joints and the spine rather than midsole strike. So an easy way to move from a heel strike, because we have a heel on our shoe typically that makes us heel, hit heel strike, to a midsole strike is there's a couple different ways that you can do it. Um, the first way is just like pretending you're jump roping we land on our landing pad to jump rope and we typically don't even put our heels all the way down when we um, jump rope, which is okay. Not when you're jumping two feet at a time or if you're trying to work on that ankle flexion, you don't want to be doing that. But for this exercise um, and training our body to run, we're not going to put the heel all the way down. So you're going to be jumping on your landing pads and then you start running. And your stride is going to be much smaller in a sole strike a midsole strike run than it is a heel strike. You can make a bigger stride in a heel strike than you can midsole strike. Um, just keep that in mind as you run it. it and it's gonna take time to practice this and to get your body used to it and familiar with it so it becomes automatic, just like with anything else that we do. Another thing, if you have a BOSU, this is a really easy way to do it, is get on your BOSU and start doing your little job, which is midsole strike, you don't you typically land on your heel first on the BOSU, and once you start feeling comfortable with that, take off, and you're going to hit midsole strike. Now, as most of you know, I am not a runner. I will never be a runner, and I never plan to be a runner, but this is information that I know it works. Research has shown as it works. People who have, I have trained in running, this works. The midsole strike is so much safer for your body, so much better for your internal organs, your joints. It's going to give you longevity so you can run so much longer. So just keep this in mind. Take your time progressing. Train your body a little bit at a time so it becomes familiar. And next thing you know, it'll be second nature and your body's going to feel so much better, I promise. So enjoy. Have fun with this one. Bye-bye.